Let's talk about Vanna, because Vanna has several digital inputs. Yeah. So, um, which one would you recommend for the best performance and why? USB, of course. Not I, I square S. No, USB. USB. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, I believe. You, listen, um, ev everything in your in, in the life mm -hmm. has pros and cons, yeah. right? Yes. And USB is a proven solution, um, which can we and and uh, proven and well working solution. However, when improperly implemented. Mm -hmm. Um, it, it 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 can give bad results, but when improperly in, uh, implemented. But in reality, we know that even the best car can be broken by the yeah. bad driver, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that's like with USB, yeah. and you know, and I prefer using USB. But at the same time, uh, there is this uh, new trend. Uh, people believe that I square S um, is better. I believe you know it can be equal mm -hmm. to USB. Uh, it's very interesting from the engineering point of view. We will see what, what we where we go. You know with the stand. Uh, oh, oh, that's the important important thing. USB <coughs> is a standard, but uh, but but you I square S is just, oh, just the name. It's not the yeah. standard. So there are several problems with I square S. We will continue using this because, you know, for many reasons, we see that good products are um, uh, good streamers uh, yeah. are equipped with this, and we want um, a Vandla uh -huh. to be a good companion for them. But if I, if I, uh, our um, viewers, I would say, if you if you want to use your headphones with Erzo, uh -huh. use um, use a USB. That's perfectly good. I use this way Erzo uh -huh. with with uh, with my laptop. Yeah, I use it with my iPad and my iPhone as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so I be, I think you know that's a, and if and one very important thing is you know people think that 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 uh, I square is a magical solution, but you know it's a magic. Uh, it, there's no magic. There's engineering, and you can if you are a bad designer, you will, you will deliver bad design with I square as as well. It does not solve any problems. Yeah. There are a lot of not so good products. With ice, ice yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> because you can put this on the data sheet. Yeah, yeah? yeah. you can put it. Ah, we have ice cream. Yeah. We are good. No, yeah. no, 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 no. <laughs> so, um, in your personal opinion, which is the coolest feature in Vandana Golden Sound Edition? <sighs> <laughs> Um, um, this one is the golden sound position right now. Okay, <laughs> listen, it's kind of, I am proud of this package, uh, mm. as, you know, as, of all this package, uh -huh. okay? Because, you know, what we did here uh, is, DSP can, uh, like the switching power supplies, mm -hmm. has kind of bad reputation about audiophiles, okay? But it comes from the fact that you know that, that um, DSP, like these functions, mm -hmm. usually are very, very, you know, strong. It's mm -hmm. like, you know, uh, it's like you go to the restaurant and, you know, and, and you can see that something's overcooked or you know and too much salty or msg used uh, so much msg so you think initially that you know that's tasty but you think you know this is too much or there's a punch in the face mm -hmm. and you know with what we and, and, and we, we are talking about naturality mm -hmm. so uh, these functions i am very proud of them because you know what they do they are very delicate very elegant it's like you know italian italian style mm -hmm. You, you know what I mean. Yeah. That's you know this kind of very very elegant feel. It's like good wine, and and probably you know the the biggest achievement is this bus enhancement, bus bus plus, uh -huh. right? Because you know uh, usually when there when there's bus in enhancement is in in uh, in other DSP solutions, it it's it's always it's the bus is modified, uh -huh. okay, and then all others as well, uh -huh. and here. Uh, they could uh, they could modify only the, the this this particular band in uh -huh. bandwidth. Uh -huh. So so it's kind of you know it's a big achievement. And of <coughs> course the special uh, special um, uh, special things are very uh, very interesting as well. So uh, but but I would say you know that my favorite thing is is, is bus bus enhancement bus plus. Uh -oh. so it sounds like very complex EQ plugins. <coughs> uh, yes, from professional world. Yeah, some, it's not. It's, kind of. 
kind of. Yes, yeah. kind of, because it's not, it's, it's not working like this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. totally. It's got, the, the idea behind this is totally different, really. Oh, cool. So, have you considering a streaming product? Yes. Is it working? We are working on this, but it, uh, it will take time. Yeah. Okay, basically, uh, we have we know we know how to do it because okay. already discussed. But um, once we built um, Vandla, it took us several months uh, to um, to polish things inside the design, and then we um, we decided to make the Golden Sound edition. Mm -hmm. So so obviously it took us time. But now after the in Poland, you know. We always say before the holidays, after holidays, and holidays start, you know, at the end, at uh, the beginning of, of July mm -hmm. or end of June, mm -hmm. and uh, after the holidays, it start, uh, starts uh, September the first. So you always count the time like that before the holidays, after holidays. So, and during mm -hmm. the holidays, everybody is going for summer vacations. Mm -hmm. Like uh, our my, I just, I, I was just talking to my to Pavel. I called him only once during you know his holidays, asking about something. So um, and Pavel is the the R and D chief. I, I I called him to ask him. So he was in in Slovenia having his holidays. So he will be coming like in a few days time to back home, back back to work, and then you know he has to get used to to work again. And then starting in September we will be full work, fully working on streamer. So that that's how we want to do it. Now about how this uh, pronoun hypsos. Yeah, hypsos. Because I'm glad you have a dual outputs right now. Mm -hmm. But is it possible for you to uh, design a dual output with independent control? Yes, <clears throat> yes. But you know that, that. But initially we wanted to do, do it this way. But basically, listen, we are. <laughs> We are a pretty big company for this market, uh -huh. but still small. So, like we have six or seven persons in R&D. Uh -huh. okay. So, if we do, uh, because um, the new product, uh -huh. I mean, the, the, the hipsos with two independent outputs would be uh -huh. totally new product. Uh -huh. We would have to use different things inside, new display, everything new, uh -huh. and do it. Um, and then you would have to do it modu in modular way, prob probably. Uh -huh. And that means you know that we would have spent one year on on the, this kind of product now. Uh -huh. And we have, and basically, you know, there are other things we we, we will uh, we are going to okay. do now, and they are more important for us. Uh -huh. So we decided, you know. That, that this uh, this news uh, uh, two channels uh, two output hipsos, it's perfectly good for people who use uh, Ferum. There is no problem with this at all. So we prefer to to to, to deliver this design instead of a completely new one because you know we want to have this streamer. If we if we if we decide if we decided to do a new. Um, uh, hipsos with two separate outputs, new streamer would be not 2025 but 2026. Ah. You, so basically, you know, you can, and that's that. I, 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 what we were talking before, I just said this. It's funny somehow many people do not understand the issue of the time. Mm -hmm. Because you know, if you decide, if you, if you make the decision to make this mm -hmm. product, you, want, you can't do the other one. So we did, we we are for us much more important right now is streamer than having uh, the Hypsos version you mentioned. You know the reality is, and binaural audio is getting <coughs> more popular these yeah. days. So we all have the blue Bluetooth headsets. Yeah. So, what is your personal opinion on Dolby Atmos in hi-fi or high-end headphone market? It's very interesting. It's very interesting. However, you know, I still I still don't use it. So my personal opinion is kind of you know I don't have uh, I don't have it because I I listen to straight flux and you know and to, to music and uh, and maybe in not so many films or you know the, the or, or not, so, not not the material where you have already all these channels and metadata encoded because you the uh, to use it you have to have multi channel plus yeah. all the all metadata okay so the music I hear too does not have this uh, yeah. okay so basically for, for but you if you want to improve your your perception uh -huh. you can use special enhancement golden sound uh -huh. it's kind of you know it's it's it's, it's the is the step toward this mm -hmm. okay so you can use this instead but in case you know of of what you said i don't have 
big opinion. I, I, I tend to think this is a, this great thing, mm -hmm. but in the same time, you know, we wouldn't be able to pu to put it inside our duck because it needs <coughs> a, a different communication um, with the host, a different uh, and different computing power because it's all complicated. And you know, I don't. I, I, you know, we are open, you know, for, for the future. We don't know what will be in three years time, but let's say, you know, that for the moment, um, what we do, the computing power inside, inside our units, units is not big enough to put this inside. And besides, we are really not sure, you know, if it makes any sense, because now it's on the, on the, on the side of the player. I don't know. We will see. <laughs> so, okay, understand. But good. It seems like these technology are only available on like Bluetooth headsets. Yeah. Yeah. So and it seems to me it is all based on software-based solutions. Yeah. So, so that's what I said. <coughs> that's what yeah, I said. That yeah. the, the, for, for, the, for the moment is yeah. in the playback. So so maybe in the future. So can you imagine like current decks like Vandala can do like a software update to have this kind of. Yes, feature. yes, but not Vandla, no, because yeah, you know the computing processor. Yeah, it, it's about the, the processing power, so it has it would have it would have to be uh, uh, much bigger than now. Uh -huh. But you know, I don't I don't say we won't do this. <laughs> okay, because the, the experience is very special because I have AirPods Pro. Yeah, you know, when I listen to Atmos music. It's interesting. But it has to be Atmos encoded from the yeah, start. It is, yeah, it is, it is. And you know, listen, I, for example, I, I listen to kind of strange music uh -huh. because I listen, um, for example, one uh, uh, to Central European music, uh -huh. I mean, you know, to the folk music. Uh -huh. And we, we were uh, we were at Jack Place today and I asked him, you know, to, uh, to because he, um, he, he played some I don't know this flamenco, Spanish uh -huh. thing, but I ask him, you know, can you play something local? Because uh -huh. I'm interested in local things, uh -huh. right? So like, um, so uh, uh, or the mix, this mixture, you know, of of um, of metal, mm -hmm. metal music plus folk music. Uh -huh. I like this very much, okay? Uh -huh. And I don't, you know, expect that this, this, these things will be available uh -huh. via uh, Dolby Atmos. <laughs> <laughs> So anyway, that's not for me probably. Yeah. Okay. Um, the last question, the final question: Can we expect any new products from Ferrum Audio in the near future? You already asked yeah, that I question. Know, still, still <laughs> yes. That. Yes. We have. We have. Uh, first of all, we will have this um, uh, the, the, the 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 steamer. Uh -huh. That's uh, that's set. Mm -hmm. uh, but the other ones. You, in our policy, when talking about new products, we never talk about this be allowed because you know, basically it's kind of, uh, you know that our, in our business again, yeah. it's like ah oh, we will have this 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 and time is passing by, they don't deliver anything. Oh, yeah. yeah, you know uh -huh. this. We don't do this. <coughs> basically, sometimes we change our minds, uh -huh. and um, and you know it's a, it's about you know uh, keeping your face. I mean yeah. you know you talk too much, then you know you can say. Ah, so that we didn't do. That. I don't want this. I don't want this. Okay, so basically, we 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 do a new product, and then two months after, before, or one month, or ten day. It, dep it depends upon the the product. Very shortly, very brief, briefly before the, the launch, we just uh, say hello. We have a new product. We ship it next week. <laughs> And not like you know, hello, we have a new product. We, we, maybe we'll ship it next year. <laughs> <laughs> okay, understandable. <laughs> yeah, so that's why. But but for sure, <coughs> but there are new products in the pipeline, and I believe you know that uh, that everybody who follows us and yeah. who's our, uh, and we can tell you to our fans that there will be very interesting products um, to 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 look at. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you for the interview. <laughs> thank you for your time. <laughs>